All right, we're back. I haven't played a competitive GeoGuessr in forever. I'm currently playing on 0 0.1 seconds per round. It's more fun of playing the game because why not give yourself a handicap? Mainly because if you mess up, it's okay to look bad because you are guessing 0 0.1 seconds anyways. My opponent has all the time to move around and everything and they will still go Israel on Kyrgyzstan. That's okay. 4,000 points round one. My goal is to get 800 ELO today. I've played like six games of GeoGuessr in the past like two months. If you guys don't believe me, it's true. So I will be washed, but that's okay. It's like riding a bike, right? This video is sponsored by NordVPN. So I'm officially a YouTuber to deal with it. So we'll probably get into that a little bit later, but kind of just wanted to sit down and just like update everyone and just like life, GeoGuessr, all of that type of stuff. This is Malaya, Thailand. This is Thailand. If you guys don't know, I just got back from climbing Mount Kilimanjaro. Someone did about like a week ago. Holy f that was insane. I'm never going outside again. I'm just not. I look like Andorra. But uh, very, very, very hard thing. If I knew what I was signing up for, I definitely wouldn't have done it, but we did it and that's all that matters. GG's. Round four Elim, not too bad. We'll pick up some Elo from this guy. Keep it going. Ooh, we got some 800 rank ELO here. Let's see if I can get some off this. But yeah, so I just summoned the Kilimanjaro. I'm gonna make a whole video on it, guys. Don't worry. It'll probably come in the next week or so. I'm trying to work on some things on that. Yeah, I'm in Stockholm right now. Stockholm, if I was to remake my tier list video that I did for cities a couple of weeks ago, Stockholm is definitely an A tier. One of the best cities in Europe by far, that at least that I've been to. It's like one of the probably the best. I love it here. Shout out to Stockholm. If you guys wanna know why I'm in Stockholm, it's because the Geogesser World Cup. Oh my god, dude. Cool. Do we have to do this again? Classic world map moment. The Geogus World Cup qualifiers are this week in the 26th. If you guys are interested in watching some of the highest level gameplay of Geogus, you're probably going to see in a while. The participants are quite insane live this Saturday on Twitch. What was this, by the way? I wasn't looking. Do you go Chile or Peru? Or do you go South Africa? No, no. We're driving right, I think. Yeah. It's probably going to be like somewhere on the coast of Peru, though, if I had to guess. Oh, okay. More north in Santiago. Trust your instinct, I guess. Yeah, so I'm in Stockholm. Geogus World Cup is 26. Definitely tune in on Twitch.tv tv slash you guys or slash rainbow to watch that or wherever i'm not sure where it's streamed qualifiers for the main event that's fifty thousand dollar prize pool october 13th and 14th that you guys can buy tickets to if you want on geogester's website because there's a live audience on the 14th in stockholm pull up i'll be there let me lock in real quick somewhere in brazil maybe token teens but yeah so that's about all the updates i have i have a lot more i want to talk about but i probably can't yet i'll give it a couple weeks i was token teens i could have won there dude whatevs around six two x pavement is that uh, it's just like eastern europe somewhere probably bulgaria now if in hindsight is probably where i'd go that's okay i'm not gonna lose 4600 points on the round like this and it was bulgaria and he went in mexico that is gonna be quite the bit of elo we get there we're at 764 now so we'll take that but yeah heading back to the u.s for a month next week i'm the first time kind of really settled down back in the u.s for a bit okay 704 rating let's see what we can do here round one i got locked in do I go UAE here or do I go like Israel or do I go Saudi Arabia and hedge UAE in Israel? I don't know if I see that being UAE. I'm kind of just goaded. I'm not going to lie. The him factor right now is at least 4,000. But yeah, what else do I have to talk about? Is it Scotland? Watch it be one of these islands up here. If it's one of these islands up here, I show feet. <clears throat> oh, it's Faroe Islands. Does that count as one of those islands up there? If I thought it was a Scottish island? I don't think so. I'm just gonna instance in Mexico. This is probably like somewhere in Arge though. And I kinda just got skill issued by this game. Why this in Mexico? Is it ever? It's probably Arge. Ooh, Puerto Rico. That's okay. My teammate went, or I keep saying teammate, or opponent went Uruguay. These rounds where there's like no multi don't really mean anything at all, to be honest, because I won't blunder that bad to where I miss so much damage. But I think for not playing the game for like two months, I'm doing kind of well for myself. The more you play Geogester, or the more active you are, the better you're gonna be. Cause it's like a muscle and you have to train that muscle. And if I'm, my, my brain muscle for this game isn't really trained well by right now. So my intuition on things are kind of not the best, but all in all, I'm still playing pretty good. Is that Paxe or is that India? I'm gonna go Paxe here. It could be VNTN or it could be... Dude, uh, bro. I hate this game, dude. I actually don't hate this game. I love this game. Oh my God, what was that yellow center line with that road condition? What actually is that? Is that Brazil? Yellow center line, I have to go Mexico, right? But that road quality was horrible. I mean, that can't be like Ukraine or something, is it? That's never Ukraine. It's never Europe. But that road quality, I don't think I've seen anything like that there. I'm blundering so bad right now, brother. To be fair, I feel like my second callouts both times have been like pretty decent. Could be like Manitoba or something or Sask. So I'm gonna go like North Dakota, hedging kind of like the Iowa region. Also, the pavement kind of did look kind of Texan, but I do not think this is ever Texas. I think this should be fine, yes. Somewhere in the prairies, probably. 
I think I literally just don't want to win this game. I just don't think I want to win. I don't want it that bad. This is Sri Lanka. I just won. See, he probably had NordVPN installed in Bangladesh, which is good because for privacy and safety, it's important. But I was trying to watch Breaking Bad in South Africa and I couldn't. Wanna know why? Because South African Netflix won't let you. So put me in the US where I can actually watch Breaking Bad on Netflix. And I did. And I finished all five seasons in three weeks. And I, you know what's crazy about that too is I was never spoiled. For like the 15 years Breaking Bad's been out, I never knew how anything ended ever. Great series. If you guys want, use this link right here. It's the best deal you're gonna get on the internet. 30 day money back guarantee NordVPN is amazing I've been using NordVPN for a while I'm unironically for traveling and things like that where is this hungry if this isn't hungry that's bad but yeah I've been using NordVPN for a while because it's actually a great thing to use in my opinion uh, especially when you're traveling and things like that or just kind of be like internet safety you know VPNs are sick and NordVPN is great and they're supporting me so you should support them and um, if this is Ireland I'm very sad but that's okay shout out to NordVPN and uh, I'm gonna get back to my try hard here I've officially made it as a YouTuber by the way like I actually made it kind of crazy I just need to have a podcast now and then I'm kind of just like I've completed all the checklists why did I think that could be Lebanon Trekker. That's a wild guess. I'm gonna do it. Risky for the biscuit. Why not? I got nothing to lose. This guy's not gonna beat me. I'm kind of just like him. And if it is actually Lebanon Trekker, that's kind of a cool clip. If it's not, it's gonna be like UAE or something probably. That's embarrassing. Yeah, that's embarrassing. It's okay though, you know. Geographically, we weren't that far away. What is that? That's gonna be like Argentina or something. Dude, I don't know what this is. Actually, it feels more European. There's no multis. So I don't think our teammate's gonna get 4,600 points on this. We have a coast to the north. That makes me feel way more Europe. I don't know what I'm doing, dude. I'm guessing in the water somewhere in Europe. Did I just lose? I didn't lose. Where was it the Philippines? Oh, it was Palawan. Ah, oh, that's a skill issue on my end. I'm not gonna lie. Bro, that was not 0.1 seconds. What was that? Somewhere over here in Europe. We're getting the multis now, so I can actually theoretically lose with like a simple mistake. So what is that guess by brother getting Western Ukraine? Okay, only losing 266 points. We're fine. Also, guys, I'm guessing in 0 0.1 seconds. My teammate or my opponent is not. Is that Northern Colo? Or is that Peru? And I just fumbled. It should be Northern Colo. Like maybe even more north, like up here. If it's not, it's Peru or Mexico, and I just lost. Did I go Cambodia there? Driving right? I just sent it, I think. I, I think I just sent it. Is it ever Africa and it's like Nigeria or Ghana or something like that, though? Possibly. I'm gonna lose it. Lock in. I'm not even locked in, dude. I lied. I wasn't locked in. That's like Finland or something, isn't it? How many times has my second guess been like the 5k? <sighs> Texas round. That's fine. I don't, I don't care that much. It's no multis. He's picking up like a thousand, a couple thousand points. It's fine. Oh my God, dude. I went and got a haircut in Tanzania. This is a funny story. I probably should save this for the Kilimanjaro video, but I don't have video or anything of it, so I probably won't make it. But I went and decided I wanted a haircut in Tanzania. I think it's fun to get haircuts in like every country you go to because it's like a different culture for like anywhere you go. And so I pulled up to Tanzania in Moshi. Let me lock in. And I was like, okay, I need a haircut. I was with like the local guy that was climbing Kilimanjaro with us. You have to go with like a guide. And he took me like five different barber shops and he refused to let me pay the foreign price that the barbers were trying to get me to pay. Is that Lithuania or Poland? Let me go Poland. Which was like $3, right? I was like, dude, I'll pay the price. Like, it's fine. I'll pay $3 for your haircut. But he wouldn't let me. And we finally found this barber. And it was like 50 cents for a haircut, right? And I just, it was Lithuania. And I showed him like a photo. I'm like, I knew he wasn't going to be the, like, it wasn't going to be the best haircut ever. I just kind of didn't care. Like, hair grows back. And, um, the UAE. That was a weird UAE location if it was. I'm trying to tell a story and, and guess in 0 .1 seconds. It's not the easiest thing to multitask. He didn't even own a pair of scissors. That was Portugal. He didn't even own a pair of scissors. So I was sitting there and he just like, yeah! for like 10 minutes and then done. And to cut the top of my hair, he just, I wasn't looking. It was somewhere in Asia. I'm such a coward, I'm doing it. Um, But you know what, it turned out okay, you know? Hair grows back, so it's really not that big of a deal. Ooh. I just lost. I don't like losing to bad players. That's not very nice for me to say that he was a bad player. He was probably fine. I have to be a better example. I'm gonna be wholesome this game. This German lad is such a baller guy. He's gonna make so many great guesses. Probably play a couple more of these games. Maybe I'll go into I lose a game. That'll be fun. We'll should be very quick with guesses like this. Round two, lock in Trevor. France? Oh, I also lost my monitor, my second monitor in TSA in Arkansas. And so I've just been using one monitor for like the past like two months and it kind of sucks. Cause I had like a 240 Hertz monitor that was like kind of great for guessing in GeoGuessr. Now like, 
Mm, not the most fun. It was like $700 too for like a portable monitor. I probably should go get it. They're like at least called and ask if they have it. Uh, this looks like Thailand. Could be Philippines though. This guy's name is quite R2S2XD2. It looks like a password, like a randomly generated password. Chiang Mai. I've quite literally been there on that road. Because I may or may not have big news regarding Thailand in the next couple of months. Spoils. That was not Spain, you silly goose. Where do you go here? You go Bal you go Finland or something? Scandinavian over here? Or something Baltic? Yeah, I'm going in the Baltic Sea right here. Hedging five different countries. Surely one of them's close enough. Wow, what a great guess. This guy's mad. Mad because bad. Oh, nope. I was going to be wholesome this game. Great guess. You know, Poland, very close guess. That is the Philippines. That's the easiest Philippines of my life. Ooh. We were driving right. He didn't guess. Guess it up. Posture check. Please log out. Really? It became personal with me. You can't blame me for 0 0.1 seconds on that. You can't. That looked like Gen 4 in 0 0.1 seconds. My ELO is horrible. What's my ELO? 723. Good lord, I'm bad at this game. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I'm tired of this. <laughs> I'm in danger. Oh, I feel bad now because I'm about to take this guy's ELO. And he's kind of high ELO. It's clearly Eastern Romania. Nice. Where did I go wrong? I lost a friend. Should I have a GeoGuessr series where I like actually try instead of like it's like 0 0.1 seconds? Maybe that's more entertaining. I actually don't know because I could probably sit here and get masters. What if I did a series speed running masters? See how quick I could get like our champion or whatever the frick it's called. Whoever the highest one. I don't even know what the highest one is. Am I cheating right now? I'm not using blink on this account. Kind of not very cool of me. But that's okay because coping in life is kind of just a part of it. You know, like if you can't cope in life. What do you really have? Right. I feel bad for taking that guy's elo. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, play again, back out. That guy gets a free win. I'll get my elo back down Ooh. and I'll play another game. Okay, there's battle countries. I can play ranked. If you guys don't know my history, I have at least 4,000 games in BR countries. I sat here for like nine hours a day and played this for like at least majority of my first two years I played GeoGuessr. And I don't think I've played this for a while, or at least in over a year. I'm gonna try one, see how it does. I'll play NMPZ. Actually, I'll try playing Blink Mode on this. That would be fun. Oh my God. I have three lives and 50 50s. Okay, Romania maybe? I can use my opponent's guesses here as help too. Be Bulgaria. Okay, what's Bulgaria? You make it past round one, that's okay. Round two. It's free South Africa. You guys, I probably have at least 90 hours of Fortnite like every week so far for like the past like three months. It's, I'm addicted. And I just bought the gritty. Gritting on kids. Ah oh, man, I wasn't I'm going in though. Ooh, ooh. Give me another game, give me another game. Ooh. Wait, what? That's embarrassing. It was guaranteed that was low game. God, I'm so washed. You go Russia or Ukraine. Ooh. Ooh. Off. Ugh. I have to win this game. If I don't win this game, that's just... I have a 50-50. I, I, I I'm not gonna use a 50-50 though. I'm not gonna use a 50-50. It could be Czech or Slovakia. I like Slovakia here. I'm gonna see what the other, my, my opponents guess here. There you go, Sweden. That's weird. Ooh. Not Slovakia. Feels like this region. Someone guessed something in this region. Ooh. Oh, Belgium? Why are they guessing Belgium and... Yeah. Ooh. This is my game. This is my game. Guys, my teammates aren't guessing zero point seconds. I like to let that be known. What? Yeah, I should just retire. To be fair, it's only my intuition that's gotten worse cope. I'm fine not in zero seconds anymore though. I think I, I've hit the boomer age. I'm like, what do you say f me for? I'm gonna win this game. There's no way I don't win this game. Dude, do I, why do I wanna go Ukraine or Baltics there? Someone guess, is there anyone in here I trust with a close guess? Ooh. Nope. 
Someone make a guess, you silly goose. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, Poland. Oh my god. It's gonna be Latvia or Estonia. It's Latvia. Happy Latvia. Let's go. I mean, my first guess was Lithuania, so. And look at that. You have to give me Lithuania on that, guys. Come on. Come on. All right, top three. Top three. This guy's not making it through. Sorry, Cowboy Phil. No, he's not making it. He made it. God damn it. 